This is Dr. B. We're going to take 6 and we're going to divide that by 25. We're going to use long division. The way I like to think about it is 6 over 25. We want to know how many times 25 goes into 6. That's 6 divided by 25. So let's do this. Since 6 is smaller than 25, we should get a number less than 1, a decimal. So we take 6 and we want to know how many times 25 goes into 6. So it doesn't go into 6. But if we put a decimal point in a zero, 6.0, 0, that's still 6, and we can put a decimal point up here. Now, 2 times 25 is 50. and we subtract, we end up with 10. 25 doesn't go into 10, but if we move over 1, we can call this 6.00, 0, still 6, then bring that 0 down. We end up with 25. 4 times 25 is 100, and we're done. So 4 times 25, that's the 100, subtract, no remainder. So 6 divided by 25, that's 0.24. Usually put a 0 here just so we remember the decimal point. If you take 0 0.24 times 25, you will get 6. It's Dr. B dividing 6 by 25, long division. Thanks for watching.